my friends did a comic book a while ago called Shitty Watchmen. Yeah, I've got it. That's it. I can't believe <laughs> that. <laughs> so awesome. <laughs> Your thoughts on it. And it is full of shitty drawings. <laughs> And I guarantee you, and this is absolutely true, every cliffhanger I have ever written, I have had no idea nice. how to get out of it. He didn't write this specific issue, it was actually James Tynan. I think I know the answer, but like, why don't I just like call James? And, uh, is it okay if I answer it with them from you? Unless a creator makes it absolutely canon on the page, this is my interpretation of the events. Everybody here is awesome. Yeah, it's not like a, it's not like a, you suck. This is like, layouts and stuff. I'll, I'll lay out a book on a big uh, piece of paper like this. The more that I can do smaller, the better. The Fantastic Four comics I did with Walter Simonson was probably my favorite. It was so hilarious when he asked me to draw them. He called me up. Hey, I'm behind on my schedule. Can you help me catch up on my deadline? You know who you're talking to. Why is why, <laughs> why am I the guy? After I've written it, all right, well, I think there's a TV version. What is this? Huh, is this a musical? This is a bad idea. Who wanted uh, the governor as a zombie? Is that all right? Uh, Maggie. Uh, you, Tim, wanted Michonne, pirate Michonne. What was it like going into Sil Silver Surfer after like Jim Starlin? Jim's the one that got me in the business. I say I co-wrote issues with him. Basically, I wrote those issues and Jim told me what I screwed up and then I fixed it. But I just kind of followed in Jim's footsteps. It was all a huge learning experience. I didn't understand how much I was learning at the time because it was really like winning the lottery. I don't have like a huge art collection. There are certain things that I've picked up over the years that you know that I really enjoy. An artist named uh, Dino Battaglia, an Eduardo Riso page that wasn't used. Eddie Bukovic, who did such really beautiful work. I'm absolutely thrilled by the HBO Watchmen TV series. Dana Lindelof and his guys approached me in a very respectful way. They wanted to be very faithful to what Alan and I had done. I forgot I was Dave watching Gibbons. I was just a fan watching the TV and I nice. thought, that's one of the best hours of TV I've seen in my life. I want to say thank you to all you guys so, so much for, for doing this. There's nothing that I don't, I, I don't feel comfortable talking about. I'm talking to much more interesting people than you right now. I'm, I'm actually, I'm, I'm, on, I'm on a Zoom call with a bunch of Hero Initiative uh, enthusiasts. Nobody should have to go to the wood. Shut up. Now, now you know what my professional life is like, okay? You happy now? You seen this?